Good morning, or depending on when you're watching this, good afternoon, good evening, or good night. My name's Ross, and as always told, out of voice of the radio, so today we need to have a look, because I think this is pretty important, because I've had a bunch of questions about this, we need to have a look at retailer exclusives. That is to say, things that can only be found in certain places because it is starting to get a little bit confusing and there are some products out there that you need to know about. So I'm here to tell you firstly where you can find them, but also whether they're actually worth picking up or not. Sound good? Good. So let's start off with one which is coming to Amazon. It is the Paradox Powers EX Special Collection. Now, this is only found at Amazon, and interestingly enough, this does seem to be a worldwide thing. So, if I go to Amazon UK, for instance, I will find this, which is awesome. This makes me happy. It is available over on Amazon, and it is listed as an Amazon exclusive. As a side note for people in the UK, this isn't really what I was planning to cover in this video, but the Kyurem V-Box, which came out ages ago at this point, is available over on Amazon for 20 quid, listed as an Amazon exclusive, and that's one I've not seen in many places. So it's not what we're actually talking about in this video, but, you know, since it's here, just a, a quick shout out to you lovely ladies and gentlemen, like me in the UK, this is one that might be worth picking up. But the Paradox Powers, it is 30 quid over in the UK and $35 over in the US. And it's actually an extremely cool product. But I warn you, and this is pretty important, there's nothing new here. Nothing in this box, as far as I'm aware, as always, happy to be corrected in the comment section if I'm wrong. As far as I'm aware, when I say nothing new, I'm, I mean literally nothing new. We've got a reprint of Maridon EX, which is a very good card, incidentally, to see a bunch of play. We've got a reprint of Kuridon EX, which is a very good card that sees a bunch of play. We've got a Jumbo Cyclazar. Always nice to have a Jumbo item. But we had a Cyclazar EX box that had that Jumbo Cyclazar in. As far as I'm aware, there is nothing new. You also get yourself five packs. And look, five packs plus a Maridon plus a Coridon plus a Jumbo for 30 quid. That's honestly not too bad. I don't mind that at all. And Maridon is a great card. Although to be clear, don't buy this to play Maridon. If you want to play Maridon, buy the Maridon League Battle Deck, which has two Maridon and a bunch of other cool stuff and is one of the absolute, as I've told you many times before now, one of the absolute best things available right now in the Pokemon TCG. Like one of the absolute best products available in the Pokemon trading card game is this. And if you're looking to play competitively, you absolutely should buy it. So yes, it's just two EXs reprinted and a Jumbo reprinted, and it is completely inessential. But for what it's worth, it's pretty cool, and it is available over on Amazon. So if you want it, go and pick it up. Now, another thing that doesn't have much new, although there is one thing which is a little bit of an exception, is the Gyarados EX Premium Collection. And this is actually very, very cool. I like this one. And what you get here is Gyarados EX. Full art Gyarados EX, which is awesome. Although, it is just a reprint. It is not a new Gyarados EX. It is not an alternate art. Remember we had the Charizard EX Premium Collection with full art Charizard. And it was an alternate art. This is a very similar product. But there is one very important difference... And the very important difference is, this does not have an alternate art. It does have a Rev Hollow Magic Arp, which is cool. It has a bunch of packs. And it does have a card frame, which incidentally, this is a new thing to which I was referring. The Magic Arp isn't new, it's a Reverse Hollow. The Gyarados isn't new, it's a full art, which is awesome, but it's a reprint from Scarlet and Violet Base. Obviously, the packs aren't new. If they had exclusive packs, that would be weird. And I would not be popping it into a retailer exclusive video. We would be doing a big shouty video about it because it would be amazing. But we still do get a lovely card frame here. And we do get the Gyarados. It's a really nice little product. Oh, I haven't actually told you yet, have I? This is a GameStop exclusive. All right. This is a GameStop exclusive. So if you want to get this, well, as I've kind of told you, you have to head over to GameStop. 
It is currently listed for $40. Weirdly, it doesn't actually show the price. I don't know why GameStop does this. It's weird to me. Uh, but it doesn't actually show the price over on GameStop. So I've had to show you the Google search rather than the actual listing on the website. Because the listing on the website doesn't show the price, but the Google search does. It's $40. It's in stock. Obviously, in other places, it's going to be available elsewhere. I believe in the UK, this is actually shown at Game. This is where you can go and buy it. Yeah, it's Game where you can buy this in the UK. I can't do this for every country. I sincerely wish I could. For obvious reasons, I can't. But over in the UK, this is a Game exclusive. So, yeah. If you're in the UK, you'll be familiar with Game. That's where you can go. 45 quid in game if you're wondering and yeah 40 dollars is a fair bit cheaper than 40 quid so 45 quid yeah we're losing out a little bit here but as i've explained in multiple videos in the past unfortunately it just costs more to get some of these products to europe and that is the way it goes Another one I'm weirdly fond of is the Evolving Powers Premium Collection. It is found in the US in Target and in Canada in Indigo Books. And this is actually really cool. Because you get yourself a Gardevoir V and a Magnezone V. A Gardevoir V Max and a Magnezone V Star. And then Gardevoir EX and Magnezone EX. So they're really throwing the shiny cards at you here. Which I really, really like. And yeah, if you want to be cynical about this, and I know some people do, and that's absolutely fine. If you want to be cynical about this, you can go, well, see, none of those cards are expensive cards. We can go and pick all these cards up as singles. And yeah, you can. And you'll probably pick them up for a fair bit less than the box costs. And if that's what you want to do, it's a fair point. It's absolutely a fair point. But you know what? This is a pretty cool product. Now, it is 60 bucks. And you get yourself your promos, and then you get yourself seven booster packs, and then a V-Star marker and a code card and all of that. What it doesn't show you on the front of the box, although it is absolutely there because we can see it on the back, you do actually get yourself two cards featuring Magnemite and Magneton, and two cards featuring Routes and Curlia. So you do actually get quite a lot of cards in addition to the seven packs for 60 bucks. And this is one of those where if you want something that's really cool and different, this is a great product to pick up. If you want something where you're getting a bunch of exclusive promos, no, none of these cards are exclusive. I just told you that. And also, most of these cards are pretty cheap, although Guard of War EX is, as we know, one of the best decks in the format right now. So this is a very easily ignored product, and it's not the cheapest one out there, but this is a pretty cool product. As a side note, this is exactly the kind of product where if you ever see this on sale for a fair bit cheaper, I would, I would recommend this one quite highly. This seems to me like the kind of thing where if you can pick this up on sale, saving a bit of money, this is actually a very, very cool product. You have been warned. Now, one that I've talked about quite a lot, so we don't need to go too much into it, is the Pikachu VMAX Premium Collection, which is going to be found over at Walmart. Now, this is actually a product that we covered in a video a little while ago. And the reason, essentially, is because this was a new product. Now, you've got to be careful with this one, because there are multiple versions of it. There is a version out there that has five booster packs rather than seven and doesn't have the pin badge. And I think it's like $5 cheaper, which incidentally is not worth it given the difference in the two packs and the pin. But yeah, that is um, that is special. This is good. I like this. Now, admittedly, you get yourself two extra packs and a pin, but also it's Crown Zenith. And Crown Zenith has to be on the way out. Crown Zenith cannot be in stock everywhere for much longer. It just can't. We got too many other sets coming out. And the Pikachu V and V Max are exclusive to this set. They cannot be found anywhere else. This is the only place you're going to find them. 
And look, if you don't have the Akira Igawa Pikachu, you really need to go and buy this sooner rather than later. Honestly, $55 for seven packs of Crown Zenith and the promos and the pin and the jumbo. And it's lovely Akira Igawa artwork on the jumbo. I'm just saying, right, of all the things I'm showing you today, lots of these are cool. This is the best. And I'm just saying that flat out, no question. Of all the things I'm showing you this morning, this is the coolest thing I'm showing you. Uh, so let's finish with the worst thing I'm going to show you today. And that is the Oinkaloni Xbox that can be found in Best Buy in the US and Mastermind Toys over in Canada. This one actually came out in Europe a little while ago. We've had this in Europe for a little while. And you get yourself regular Oinkalone. You get yourself a Lechonk. And a Jumbo One Cologne with some packs. Now, I say the worst thing. It's actually not that bad. Because you get Jumbo One Cologne. And actually, this is the only place to get Jumbo One Cologne. So there is actually something in here which is different. And I have a real soft spot for One Cologne. And it's really sad, right? But basically, I went to Italy to cast last year. And I bought a single pack of Scarlet and Violet in Italian. And I pulled Italian Oinkalone X. And now I've apparently got a soft spot for Oinkalone. I saw a vendor in Spain, in Barcelona, who told me they were going to bring a Spanish and a German Oinkalone to Stuttgart. Oh, by the way, the word's out. I'm casting Stuttgart regionals. That's official now. Yay, etc. I'm really excited about it. I don't know if this vendor is going to remember me. From Barcelona. And I don't know if they are going to bring me a Spanish and, and a German or in Cologne. But look, if I've cast it in Italy and Germany and Spain, and I randomly got an Italian or in Cologne in the one pack I bought in Italy, then yeah, I want a Spanish and a German or in Cologne. Will the vendor remember me? Stay tuned. I really hope they do, though. That would be awesome. But yeah, it's available at Best Buy for 22 bucks. So if you're after it, go nuts. These are all products which are only available in certain places. They are only available in these stores. You won't find them elsewhere. And outside of the Pikachu, yeah, fine. They don't have exclusive stuff in. I'm not pretending that they do. But these are still cool products that you might want to be picking up. And these are the only places you can buy them. So now I've warned you. And like I say, for some of these, it's actually worth just... Putting a pin in them, because some of these you might not want to buy now. But I do feel fairly confident that some of these you may well want to buy if they end up being a little bit cheaper, if they end up coming down in price. So just, you know, keep that in mind. Right, that's what you need to know. And now it's over to you guys. Tell me what you think about all of this. Tell me what you're picking up. Tell me anything you want to tell me in the comment section. Go nuts. Be nice. And then make sure you like this video, subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter at the Wasi. That's where we talk about Pokemon and card games and Pokemon card games, all kinds of fun things. And please do consider checking out patreon.com slash ptcgradio, where you can support the channel, get some bonus podcasts and all kinds of fun things. And get shoutouts on the channel like the lovely Smash Cafe, who have been supporters of ours for a little while now and are lovely people. So shout out to them for the support and the loveliness. But by far the most important thing as always... Look after yourselves till next time, would ya? Thank you very much for watching. My name's Ross, and you've been watching PTCG Radio.